but this time I'm glad that I'm on last because I want to uh, make sure that I thank, first of all, these ladies here. Uh, you don't know, most of well, you don't know, of course, uh, but these ladies came along tonight, and Judy back here came along and said, I've got at least two numbers that I can sing for you if Charles don't show up. <laughs> <laughs> And Rihanna comes along and she said, I've got a number ready. Uh, and, and, uh, and Judy as well. Well, uh, she's had two numbers, but uh, we thank them for being ready. And we thank them for uh, their backup plan. <laughs> I was also sitting there, and I'm, I'm sorry, but... Uh, I know I should have been there just worshiping, and it, it, it's, it was wonderful to be able to have that opportunity and just to hear the word going through. But it was also that little voice coming through as well to me, saying, we've got another person uh, when you go on holidays and we need someone to speak. Uh, we don't have to call and just Bruce and, and, and say, well, Bruce will do it. Because now we know that we can say, we've got a team coming. <laughs> right? Great job, Wendy. And uh, I don't know how many of you have picked up on that uh, phrase that she used. She, she, she put it to Bruce and said, Bruce had a God moment. Beautiful idea, a beautiful thought. And immediately I thought of, oh, uh, last night, I uh, called Bob yesterday evening and said, Bob, what are you doing around 6 o'clock or so? And uh, he said, oh, well, I'm, I'm free. And so we made our way to Old Burlington yesterday <coughs> evening at around 6, quarter after 6, because a lady had called me earlier in the afternoon uh, from the paramedics, people on the ambulance, and uh, I know you don't want to see people on the ambulance. But uh, she called me and said, we had uh, a drive, a food drive, uh, a few weeks ago, and we had another one today. And so that, what that meant is that they were with the ambulance up in front of uh, Low Foods, there are food, food, food plant, there we go. Uh, who's senior? <laughs> no, 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 no. Uh, in front of Food Land, and uh, they were collecting food. And so uh, we went down, and I know my car is not the biggest, but my car was pretty well filled with food, with cans and, and all kinds of bags uh, that they had collected. And then, as well, they uh, I said, well, well, we'll get a picture taken, uh, and we did. But they presented an envelope to me as well, and said, this is some money we collected in. Uh, okay. And I graciously accepted the envelope, and, you know, shook their hand, and had my picture taken, and, you know, we're not going to be on the telegram or anything like that. Don't with that or MTV News, it's not going there. But this afternoon when I came back home, I had a couple of envelopes in my pocket that people had given me, and then my winter coat, I took this envelope out of my pocket. Nothing marked on it. And I said, where did I get that? <laughs> so I opened it up. And would you believe? Two hundred and seventeen dollars that they had collected, that people had God moments. That's what they had. They had God moments when they came out of the store and they gave to the paramedics there, and the paramedics generously gave it to us so that, you know, on the 18th of, of December, we'll have the hamper going out back here and we'll be able to pass out to people so that they have a good Christmas. That's a wonderful thought, a wonderful thing. 
there will be others. Mrs. Rowe mentioned that the, uh, the lady at the post office uh, has got quite a few things in Western Bay, and uh, the other post offices will be, uh, I'm sure, doing the same kind of thing. And, uh, you know, other years we've had a school, we've had other organizations, uh, Food Plan itself will probably have a drive for us. So, they'll be blessed. And I trust you'll be blessed as you give and as you help out in any kind of way that you can.